baseball coach John Scalinos broke down the problems that we have in our country. With a room packed full of baseball coaches from Little League all the way up to professional, he asked, how wide is home plate? He asked the Little League baseball coaches. He also asked the Babe Ruth coaches, the high school coaches, the college coaches, the coaches in the minor leagues, and the coaches in the big leagues. How wide is home plate? The answer was the same, 17 inches. Then he asked, what happens if a major league baseball player can't throw the baseball over the plate at 17 inches? And the answer, they send them back down to the minors. He went on to say what they don't do is say, oh, that's okay, Jimmy. If you can't hit a 17-inch target, we'll make it 18 or 19 or 20. Or heck, we'll make it 25 inches. Then he asked the coaches, coaches, what do we do when our best player shows up late to practice? Or when our team rules forbid facial hair and a guy shows up unshaven? Or when he gets caught drinking, do we hold him accountable? Or do we change the rules to fit him? Do we widen home plate? The coach went on to say, that this is one of the problems that we have in our homes today. Also, with our marriages, with the way we parent our kids, with our discipline, we do not teach accountability to the kids and there's no consequences for failing to meet the standards. We widen the plate. And this is one of the major problems in our schools today. The quality of our education has been going downhill fast and teachers have been stripped of the tools they need to be successful and to educate and discipline our young people. We are allowing others to widen home plate. Where is that getting us? And this is a problem in the church where people that have had positions of authority and they've taken advantage of young children only to have such atrocities swept under the rug for years. And the same can be true with our government, our so-called representatives that make rules that don't apply to themselves. They take bribes from special interest groups and lobbyists in foreign countries. They no longer serve us and we allow them to widen home plate as we see our country falling into a very dark abyss as we sit by and watch. He went on to say, if I'm lucky, you will remember one thing from today. But it is this, if we fail to hold ourselves to a higher standard, a standard of what we know to be right, and if we fail to hold our spouses and our children to the same standards, and if we are unwilling or unable to provide consequences when they do not meet the standard, and if our schools and our churches and government fail to hold themselves accountable to those they serve, there is only but one thing to look forward to, dark days ahead. He went on to say, coaches, keep your players no matter how good they are. Keep your own children, your churches, your government, and most of all, keep yourself at 17 inches. Here's how to fix what's wrong with our world today. Stop widening the plate.